the first bounce. So the Mavericks require. And I think no one is cheering for that team, man. Mavericks guys, cheer for your team. They're doing an amazing job. All of them are eating, huh? Pritam was on. This one, once again, Pritam goes for the reverse shot. Does not make any contact whatsoever. Nine runs required of the final ten deliveries. This time, Pritam comes out to the crease and slams it across towards the fine leg area and scampers away for a single there. So, eight more from nine deliveries. Mutsu on 27 from 20. Pritam on nine from eight. Mavericks 48 for three, chasing 56 for victory. As Antosh bowls. From the far end, and once again, outside the off stump, deceiving him with that turn, and Mutsu not able to make contact as he tries to pull it away. And eight runs needed from the final eight deliveries, two more remaining in the Zowa. 48 for three, the total. Mutsu on 27 from 11. And let's see what he can do with this one. He smashes it high in the air towards Midan, but well short of the fielder. And Pritam makes the ground for a second run. A very good response there from Pritam as he dashed across to the non strikers end first. And Muthu took his own time to reach the crease before the throw could come in. There's also a wild throw. So the two of them safe in the safety of their creases. Six more from seven, the equation. This one outside the leg stump, attended by Muthu to push it across, but does not to make contact. So the Mavericks are now 50 for three. Six runs required from the final six deliveries for the Mavericks to win this match. They are now 50 for three, chasing 56 for victory. The two of them, Muthu and Pritham, doing a good job for their team with this partnership after they lost three quick wickets. But then these two have ensured that the team comes closer and closer to victory. And now they need six from six. Pritam tries to go for a mighty shot, full shot on the leg side, but uh, the ball hitting the foot of the batter and trickling across towards Shot third man, field in return, no run. As Pritham once again comes out of his crease and drives, but only a single. Five from four. Driven across towards point, they take one, they take the second as well. So, three runs required from the final three deliveries for the Mavericks two to tie the scores. Three to win the match, and the bowler making adjustments to the field to prevent the two of them from getting. It could be one of them as well, very soon. Crucial singles. And let's see 18 of 18 what uh, the 15 15 two batters 9, have 9, in 8, mind 8, to 5, score 8, those three runs eventually to win this match. Very, very 
A shot is delivery to Mutu, who tried to work it around. The ball hit his hand, I think, the handle of the bat and lowered back to him. And he took the return catch to send back the most dangerous of them all, Mutu, back to the pavilion. Prakash, the bowler, taking his first wicket, giving away six runs. Interestingly, Santosh, the captain, and Prakash, the vice captain, both are sporting the same number of jersey, number 10. And here, the wicket falls once again as the new batter. Surrender. Swung hard the ball. The bat escaped from his grasp and landed somewhere near the umpire over there. But lucky for him, the ball did not hit the bat. It had touched his hand. So he stays very much over there. And three runs now required from the final delivery. Last one ball, three runs required. A boundary should do it. 53 for four. Three runs from the final delivery from Prakash. Three runs needed from the final delivery. Captain. And he's out. <laughs> he's run out. And the Hurricanes have triumphed by one run. Surrender and Pritham took a single, wanted a second run, but the throw came in to the wicket keeper and Hurricane defeating Mavericks by one run.